Danny Burch, a U.S. citizen taken hostage in Yemen, celebrated his return to the United States on Wednesday by visiting President Donald Trump in the Oval Office. Trump announced in late February that he secured the release of Burch, who was held hostage in Yemen for 18 months. Burch's Yemeni wife claimed he was kidnapped in broad daylight in 2017 after dropping his children off at a school event. Rated, Trump secures release of Danny Birch. The president invited Birch to participate in a ceremony at the White House on Wednesday, which was also attended by Republican Sens. Lindsey Graham and Mitt Romney and Vice President Mike Pence. We have a very big moment because we have Danny Birch back home where he should be, Trump said, according to the White House press pool. He was in Yemen in a very horrible situation, a captive, a prisoner, you can call him whatever you want but it wasn't good. He was there for 18 months, a little more than 18 months, and we got him out and we had some great help from UAE and all of our friends, related, Andrew Brunson's American pastor describes harrowing Turkish courtroom experience. When Trump asked if Birch had anything to say, Birch simply leaned forward and said, gosh, it's great to be an American, watch, freed hostage Danny Birch has only one thing to say to it real Donald Trump picked at twitter.com slash t7 crx lag my, Charlie Spiring, at Charlie Piring, March 6, 2019 the group in the Oval Office applauded Birch's statement. The president touted his record in securing hostage releases, asserting that he is, 20-0, on bringing home prisoners. Follow Amber on Twitter.